Hello guys, I am Sanarov and you are watching Think Insider YouTube channel. When we go to an unfamiliar destination and come back again, it often seems like the way back takes less time than the initial trip, even though we traveled the same distance. In this video, I will explain you about the return trip effect. Without taking much of your time let's start this video. One explanation is that the return trip effect has to do with paying attention to time itself. When you pay more attention to time passing, time seems to take forever. But when you're distracted by other, more interesting things, time passes quickly. This idea is certainly present in old adages. A watched pot never boils. And time flies when you're having fun. It also helps to explain the phenomenon of time seeming to slow down when our lives are at risk. This also apparently happens in our memory. When we devote more attention to a period of time, we tend to remember that period of time as being longer. Another common explanation has to do with familiarity. On the way there, you don't yet know the route. On the way back, you recognize landmarks and other familiar sites, which makes the trip seem to go faster. It's true that people don't experience the return trip effect on journeys they take often because we've taken the route so often that we have accurate expectations about how long it will take. Thanks for watching this video.